Welcome back to Our Frame Games. My name is Chris, and I know it feels like almost every other episode I have to apologize for something, uh, but this one may have been just a tad bit out of my well, control. For the past month and a half, my computer has been itself has been on the fritz. Ultimately, what it turned out to be, and what I hope is currently fixed, is my I upgraded my computer system, but didn't upgrade my power system those who know computers, you know where this is going. For those who don't, what had happened is that when I was recording, when I was editing, when I was on Photoshop, Lightworks, Blender, even sometimes when I just had my, had a writing, you know, app open, it would shut down. Because of the power system that I was using prior, it was, I didn't have enough power to do everything at once because I had upgraded my system it was maxing out its power so my old power system works just not it doesn't have enough power output I got a new power system I've been testing it for a couple days I put it in it seems to be going well worst case scenario I, I don't know uh, their worst case scenario. Uh, the good news is that nothing else seemed to be seemed to have been damaged within my system. But for the long moment, I actually haven't turned on my computer or worked on anything or recorded for quite a while. See, Chimera, destroy all monster girls. That one had been recorded all at once before this has happened, and had been uh, filtered through the, the couple of days. Either way, we're back. We're back with Legend of Dragoon. And I forget where I'm at. Oh wait, I do remember where I'm at. We're gonna go down. We're gonna go down here and this is where I should be able to find that which is my... Meru, are you... Wait, are you here to, here to rescue me? Uh, by the way, I should be able to find my little red dragoon stone somewhere. Uh, of course! Kate's totally worried about you. Oh no! Oh no! Open! Open up! Open! I s I open the door. Open! Open! Open it. Open the door. I I'm letting you out now. Just... just the door. It won't... It won't open. Meru, 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 stop. Just stop. Just stop it. Look, if your brawn doesn't work, you, you kind of got to use your brain, Meru. I, uh, uh, Meru, thanks. I, I am not dead. Lynn's a woman, isn't she? I've said in the past, uh, the graphics of this game, especially from a distance, have not aged well. You have some ca great characters, uh, and some that have really good, you know, portraits, silhouettes. Rose comes to mind. Dart comes to mind. Albert, eh, not so much. Meru, definitely. I, I, I guess to a, to a degree, Shannon. But um, yeah. These are my pals. We are traveling together for a variety of reasons. I can't tell you because. Uh, that would be too too direct, and I don't wanna. Yes, give me praise, all of the praises. Uh, but why did you come here alone? You are not a powerful warrior like I am, and not as awesome as I am. You could have gotten yourself hurt, unlike myself. I, I wanted to solve this by myself because I, I, I reasons. Eh, whatever. Oh look, I found the story. But something had changed. Probably the person who joined him half a year ago changed Genrich. Yeah, and that person is now assuming the form of Princess Emily. We. We need to get back to that castle. And quick. Yeah. Well, that's after we find this 
stolen Dragoon Spirit because, you know, Dart here can't hold on to the most powerful weapon in this world. Yeah, um, somewhere, S somewhere in here. Thank you, thank you, Lin, for helping me. Uh, let's see. Well, this is simple. Find junk. Could it be the sparkle bit? I think it's a sparkle bit. Um, before we go to the sparkle bit, which obviously is where we need to go, let's talk to Rose. Hey, Rose. Hi. What's up, Rose? It should be easiest for you to find it because the red-eyed dragoon recognizes you. Or, or, or. No, but follow along with me. Uh, this is this is gonna get a bit very confusing. I dart. I'm not actually seeing everything in the first person view. In fact, I, since the very beginning of time, have lived outside of myself and look upon the world and everything from eyes from above, almost like a god and or a deity. It is very weird because I can't actually jump, but I see that which others do not see and also I don't know what I look like. Sparkle, sparkle. Oh, my little dragoon is so happy. Oh, they're so nice. All right, now let's go back to flats and see Princess Lisa and tell her everything. You know, the fact that her sister is not her sister? Yeah. Did you find thing? Do do Congo need help you? Do, do, you got it? Yeah, I got I got I got it. Ah, it seems you found both Lin and the Dragoon Spirit. How nice, how nice, how nice. She held on to it. We wouldn't have done had to do this, but um, so we know how this is going. Uh, first off, let's switch out. It doesn't really matter who I switch out. Most of w the run back from here to there ain't gonna do shit. You're not gonna see it unless something really important happens. So I'm just gonna bounce, and we're to meet back at the castle. Oh, right, I had linen with me the entire time. I forgot about that. Hey, we'll go into Donahue soon. Go back home real quick. The Kate's worrying. Dart, I honestly can't thank you enough. But I have to say thank you. That what? Huh? Okay, I. It. Whatever. Whatever. Oh, it's just the beginning. The mayor must be taking action now, in response to your, you know, courage, Lin. Uh, finally, that mayor is... That mayor is taking action. Well, just a little bit. What are you talking about? It's not over yet. Come again? Uh, are you... Gonna follow me for the rest of all time? Dart's journey won't be easy. Let's say you guys do it. What you guys do is not normal. Monsters like Virage appear, dra dragoons, gigantos, I thought. They only existed in fairy tales. I can't explain it, but I think there'll be a lot of things I can help you with. So, why don't we go to Fletz now? We can't procrastinate like this, right? I. Uh, can I honestly say no? Look, to be fair, I, I don't even know if Lin will be able to make it back to home without being kidnapped again. 
I'm just saying, just saying. But look, we knew Mary was gonna join us indefinitely. One, because she's joined my party. Two, be because we need another female to balance out all the testosterone. And three, she is, if everybody in town is color coded in one sense, and then you have somebody that is a completely different color code. Also, that is color coded. Cause look at look at it. Look at me. Darts red. Rose is. I, I guess like a dark blue to black. Kongol is bright yellow. Marrow is a uh, light light blue. So we are power rangers. There's just no way about that. Yes. Yay, I'm back in the town of Flitz because this fucking thing nearly took me 30 minutes just to wander all the way back here. RJ, old RGRPGs, man, they just love that time constraint. That that sound, that it, it can be, because I don't know what it is. Alright, it seems a ceremony for Princess Emily's coming of age celebration has already started. But we just found out that Princess Emily is a fake. Yeah, duh. It doesn't necessarily mean that the moon dagger has already been passed on. No, we could, because they have to wait for us. I mean, you gotta wait for me. I'm, I'm the main protagonist. Okay, fine, just take the slow esters. Me. Bad, bad people coming in without permission. How dare you? <laughs> just getting nice easy. Because the day is such a happy day. Happy, happy, happy. When did he start? Oh, a moment ago. Just, uh, but just asking doesn't mean you have an invitation. So uh, it's so packed you couldn't fit a penny in. Look, look, look at all those people. I what? Okay, there, you, you look. There's a lot of people, and it shows me guards. I mean, sure. Okay, fine. I will believe you. Uh, fine, 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 fine. Oh, oh, oh. The bandits have become knights. That makes more sense, but I mean, just... Okay, fine. Thank you, Deus Ex, you know, dudina. Uh, so let's uh, let's go and say how. Hey, how you doing here? Yeah. Who the hell are you? They're busy with an important ceremony, all right? Don't even think about bothering them. Hey, hey, can't you see our armor? We are the authentic great knights of Tiberia. The knights of Tiberia. Tiberia? And how do we say the town? Is Princess Emily over there? Whoa, 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 whoa! Can't go in there. It's not a place for commoners like you. Because it's the birthday of our princess. Wait, wait, wait. Do you really think you can get away with making a scene like that? That's special today. It's her birthday present. I'm going to take this sword and shove it up her ass. Yeah. All right, fine. Fine. Albert wins this round. Huh? 
Oh, the sister who doesn't believe that the Emily is her sister is, yeah, no, that's not shady whatsoever. So we don't get the cool fight through everything to get to Emily to punch her in the face. No, 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 no. We have to go the roundabout way. Okay, I I'm going to be honest, Dart. You really should not tell somebody that you will find a way around them. That just, it, it don't make sense. That's like saying, hey, I'm going to find a way to sneak in when you're not looking. They'll be like, okay. Now, if I were a princess, where would I be? Oh, well, duh. Tallest room of the tallest tower. Now, I believe all these to be banded, so the more, the, the longer I can avoid them, the better. Let's just go up to the tallest room. And, yep. Oh, hey, Polygon. I mean, Lisa. I have been waiting for you, everyone. I am ready. Please tell me the... Please tell me the truth. Uh, okay. Uh, so... <laughs> Funny story. See... Princess Emily attending the ceremony is a fake. Yeah, okay. It's hard to understand, but just follow along with me. A woman who is helping the bandits made the switch about a half a year ago. The star of Princess Lisa has shown the truth. The stars have shown Princess Lisa. Yeah, I don't know. But, but. Oh, thank God. It is impossible for my sister Emily to have such an attitude. But that being said, my sister has been gone for about a half a year. I am very conflicted. Now, where is my true sister, Emily? Um, do we know where real Princess Emily is? Okay, all right. All right, she's, she's confined in the castle. Got it, okay. Yeah, it was the last words of a dying man. We can trust him. Not really, because if I was going to die and I didn't like you, I would be telling you some crazy ass shit. If you fight me to the death and I'm dying, with my last dying breath, I will tell you that the one I, that the, the six-fingered man had killed your father. I don't know how far you can take that, but I would love to see you as a ghost try and find a six-fingered man. For those who don't get that, that's a Princess, Princess Bride reference. If you haven't seen Princess Bride, well, well, I'm just gonna leave it at that. It all started, it all started out of the, at the time of a horseback ride a half year ago? Maybe, there's something about a horse. By taking advantage of the fusion, the mysterious woman switched herself with the Princess Emily and took over Tiberia with the cooperation of bandits. Honestly, it's an amazing plot. I'm kind of, I don't know how they actually managed it, but I mean, it's kind of ingenious. Uh, the finale was to, was to be the coming of age ceremony when the moon dagger would be passed down. So, uh, um, Princess Lisa, we may have to go find your currently emaciated Princess Emily. Um, any ideas? Is it possible to, no, no, Shauna. It's the daytime. You cannot use astrology in the daytime. Okay, apparently she can use astrology in the daytime. This is magic astrology. This is not the astrology we're used to. If she tells me she's in a dungeon, You know, this, this, I'm, I'm gonna stop you there, Lisa. This mist you may be talking about could be called the sun. Kind of stopping the rest of the stars from, like, you know, doing the thing. Anyways, uh, your sister's being held in the, in the castle. Where in the castle could some, you hold somebody 
for half a year where nobody looks. The dungeon? Duh. All right, so let's go look for the real Princess Emily. And by look, I mean let's go to the dungeon. Go fight a boss, save her, go get the moon dagger stolen again because that's just the way the story's been going. And then we'll be good. We'll be good. Let me just go. Actually, you know what? Since I'm here, I don't know if there's an actual dungeon in this place, so let's just go upstairs. Maybe, you know, your sister's been there the entire time. I mean, if one prince is in, is in the tallest tower, why not two? Hey guys. Hey, how you doing? Oh, I'm feeling much better. So, I have to go into my sister's room now. May I come in? And by, by the way, that's not a request. That's an order as the princess. Yes, Shauna. This is pretty high up from the bottom of the tower. I don't know why you want to say this, but... Oh, okay, okay. Sorry. You know, I, I do tend to be a little bit tad bit... Harsh on Shana, but I mean, I wanted to have an addition. I really wanted to have an addition. I want to like Shana. I just, yeah. Hmm. Let's see. If I was my sister and I was locked in my room for all of six months. Duh. Look, Rose already knows where you went. we've got to look. Um, I'm probably going to skip all this dialogue. You know what's going to say? Oh no, I don't know where my sister is. She has to be in this room. We can't leave until we find her. Where could she be? Yes, let's split up and search. Blah, 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 blah. Hey, Rose, how you doing? Now, I wonder, could it be this giant poster? Oh, wow. It was a giant poster. To be fair, it was a magical portal poster, which I was not expecting. So, oh, that's actually pretty cool. Wait, wait, where, where are we? Where, what on earth is happening? It seems a magical space was created in the painting. It seems peculiar. Is this magic? Dart. Yeah, bro, well, it might be magic. Just, just a little. Oh, hey, no, we're uh, so we're we're in the painting. No, no, don't come in here. Don't, don't, don't touch it. Don't. Ah, yes. Hi, Emily. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, hey, don't, uh, don't run off into the abyss. You see the abyss? Don't, don't walk. Don't walk across that. That's not a nice thing. It is linked with different dimensions. It's too dangerous to jump over. Uh... 
See, this is always, this is something I've always found found weird about a lot of JRPGs and or just just some games in general. So we have a very simple situation, and it could be harrowing. Obviously, everything below me is connected to different dimensions. On the other side, in a in a reachable sense, is that who, which I am looking for. And now it is up to the main protagonist to find a way across after, after having been told, hey, it's too dangerous to cross, where do we go? How about we just go to the goddamn shining thing? Yeah. Now, this could simply be easy enough to have a character, let's say Shauna, just looking at this bright glowy thing and touch it on accident as everybody is thinking about how to fix it or get how to get across and in fact her doing that gives her more agency forces me as a main character to not have to worry about doing every little thing and and on the flip side even if something does go horribly wrong it gives a reason to, it gives reason to I one never do that again. Two, you know, go save her. Three, I don't know, just do something. When it stops, this, when the story, it, I've always felt weird when it's when the story goes, then stops, does dialogue, and then, in order to it continue the rest of the dialogue, I have to walk three paces, press a button, hit a thing. When if the one if you want to tell me a story, tell me a goddamn story. I don't, as a main protagonist, I don't always have to be the driving force. The characters need their need their own agency. Rose don't give no shits. She's here to see what you do. Shauna, her agency is to be with me, and Albert, he's trying to protect. He's kingly. He's like he might he would not touch something he would not he wouldn't know. Shauna. She, she would be ideal just to touch something randomly. Or Meru, but Meru is not here. Hey, uh, Princess Emily. I know you've been sitting here for about six months, haven't really moved, may or may not be dead. But, uh, hi. Hey, how you? Wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Oh, hey, I know you can't wake her up, but let me do it and just, and just shake the shit out of her. That's not, that's not going to help him. He just really shook the shit out of her. Lisa, and, and, and you, who I don't know, where, where am I? Well, you've been sleeping for the past six months since we went to horseback riding. See, story goes is you went horseback riding, got caught, turned up, uh, got switched with the body double. We didn't really think anything of it because we, you know, even though she acted completely different, looked exactly like you, and, you know, was kind of a bitch. We didn't think of it. You've been asleep here. We haven't even thought about looking for you because I'm not that great of a sister. Just want to put that out there. Not that great of a sister. Even with my power of astrology, I did not think to figure something out. I um, I was sleeping for for half a year since since the horseback ride. And, and okay, fine, fine, okay. I will. I'm calm. I'm the princess. I'm calm. Um. What uh? What about the coming of age ceremony? Yes. What about the uh the moon moon dagger? And what about the fact that I've been asleep been asleep for like six months? Didn't think to just look for me. Didn't think to like, hey, why is this person impersonating my sister who I've known for all my life? She's uh, suddenly my sister is not acting like my sister. You couldn't just come visit. I'm into my room. Touch the goddamn painting. Find the painting. Touch something magic sparkly. Just no, no, just fuck. 
Uh, so, okay, okay, good, good. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Um, so, the dagger is about to be passed over to her, the other person. Uh -huh. Can you, uh, can, can you explain to this other person who took over my life for the past six months? And please, oh please, make it interesting. So, ah, it seems I've troubled you a lot. A lot due to my absence and the fact that I was kidnapped, but I'm calm. I'm calm. Okay, okay. Let us go to the uh, the chamber of the sun. We have to let people know the truth. I'm sure, it's not gonna be weird to have a person that looks exactly like a princess just appear randomly next to another person who looks exactly like a princess and has been the princess for six months because nobody bothered to goddamn look for her. 